So being able to shoot a digital movie is fun in its own right. And it's nice to see your footage play out on screen. But sometimes you want a little more excitement. So to do a time stretch and reversal, we want to right clip. Go to clip here. We're going to go down to time stretch. And you can either change the speed to make it go faster, change the speed to make it go slower, or you can input a custom time based on minutes, seconds, and microseconds here in the dial. So let's say we want it to play much faster, and we can either drag out to the right by holding down our left click, or we can input the time manually by clicking on it a second time and then using the keypad to input our preferred time. We hit this and suddenly our video is much shorter and when we watch it, it turns out rather funny. Or we can slow it down by once again going to clip, time stretch, making it go down to just 50 by once again typing it in. Which is still pretty funny and there are useful uses for this as well. It all depends on what your vision is. So we'll just take it back to the original and help our friends out here. And that is as far as speed goes if you want to make it roll faster or roll slower and of course you can do this in non-talking videos like if you want to see something sped up for effect or if you want to do a slow motion per se I, it all it also depends on your frame rate that you shoot in I, it should work fine for most average frame rates though so we're going to go back to time stretch but what we want to do is hit this button right here and check that box that says reverse speed and we're going to hit ok and this takes us to the end of the video. So if we hit play. Our footage will play in reverse. So there's a lot of options as far as this goes. As I said, whether you want something to be sped up for effect, like in an action scene, or if you want a slow motion uh, of a funny fail, or if you want to roll part of a clip in reverse for a cinematic effect, it, it all depends on what you do. Remember, just right click, go up to clip, and go down to time stretch. And there's all your options.